What's up guys Raj here and welcome to a brand new video on the channel and today's video I'm gonna show you how to transfer data or any content to your Android smartphone to your PC wirelessly. Sharing data between an Android smartphone and Windows is not difficult today. There was a time when the only way you could share content between your phone to PC was by using a USB cable. But these days, tons of wireless sharing options available such as Sharit, AirDroid, ES File Explorer and old Bluetooth etc. Yesterday I want to share file on my Android device to PC via Sharit but the every time the connection disconnected. In simple words, it cannot be connected. I totally frustrated the disconnection of Sharit so finally I decided to choose another option. So here I choose ES File Explorer. ES File Explorer is one of the most common used and popular file manager for Android and iOS users. Because this file manager supports root access and tons of options available on this file manager. ES File Explorer supports network lane option. So now how this method works? Watch this video till the end. So the first process on your desktop and the process is very simple first of all go to your my pc now select any drive that you want to share with your another device such as your smartphone and tablet now here i select my f drive now simply right click on it at the bottom select properties now click on this sharing tab Select advanced sharing. Check out this blank box. Now click on permission tab. Now your every one option is select. Now here you can see three options. If you just want to see your content or PC file, then select read only. But if you want to share it, I mean you want to copy, cut, paste, rename any files between your PC to mobile, then check out this full control option. Click on apply, ok and close it. Now the next step. You need to know your IP address. So how to see your IP address? Simply search CMD on the search box and open command window. Now you can see my command window appears. Now type IP config and press enter. You can see it cannot show anything because my system is not connected to the internet. So the next step on your smartphone. Turn on your mobile hotspot. I think everyone knows the how to turn on the hotspot. But I telling you how to turn it on. First of all, go to your device settings. Now hit on more. Select tethering and portable hotspot. Turn it on. And you will configure your hotspot setting here. Such as password and name of your Wi-Fi hotspot. Now your tethering is open. Now go to your laptop, search Wi-Fi and here you can see my Wi-Fi name and it's connected with my mobile. It's so connected but no internet because I turn off my mobile data connection. Now again do same process. Open your CMD and type IP config. Now you can see it's on my IP address. Now the next step on your smartphone. First of all, obviously you need a file explorer. So download the file explorer on Google Play Store. And once the software is downloaded, open it. Swipe left and tap on network option. Under network, select lane. Now tap on the scan option and it will show your PC IP address. Here you can see it show my PC name and IP address. Now tap on it. Now enter your PC username and password. And I select to remember the password for future update. If it cannot be show your desktop IP address, check out the above method carefully or hit on this new tab and fill all information. The first field is domain name. Enter anything in this field. 
and the second option enter your server IP address. Finally your PC username and password. But if your phone scan your desktop, forget this process. Tap on OK. Now you can see the desktop drive or folder on my mobile. Remember I cannot access the dollar sign folder because I cannot enable shared option on this drive. As you know, I shared my F drive to my mobile. So now I hit on F. Now you can see it so my old F drive folder. The same folder you can see on my PC. Now you can easily share file between your PC to mobile and mobile to PC. Here I show you an example. Tap on this little icon. And now your mobile folder is open. Now I cut one of my files and paste it on my computer drive. I select this app, again select network and option and you can see it paste on my PC drive. So do reverse process if you want to paste PC to mobile. So guys I think you understand this process but still if you got any problem comment below. If you like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe my channel. And I always thank you for watching. My name is Raj and I will see you next time.